Holy Spirit is just this opening up to this experience of guidance and it's just that the ego misuses the concept so much um, that and can the I am guided, I am guided concept and the words can be used and and misused and so on and so forth and it's kind of, that's like more when I go to uh, particularly Europe, when I've gone to, to Sweden and different countries in Europe, there's just been so many seeming centuries of misuse, we'll say seeming abuse of these religious symbols, that there's a huge burnout, you know, mm -hmm. that, that there's, the church attendance has been on the decline for, for a long time because of the, the like, bad taste that people have in their mouths around the whole idea of church. You know, it's like a, like a four-letter word over in Europe. One of our friends is coming, uh, Sarah is going to come and spend some time and work really close with us. She is from Ireland, and so the whole history of the Protestants and the Catholics, it wasn't so much a, a church thing per se, as it was this, this fighting and firebombing and war going on for decade upon decade upon decade and finger pointing and everything mm -hmm. all in the name of Christianity you know it yeah. was just like almost like a repulsion or a revulsion with the very idea of, of using this symbol mm -hmm. and it, so that began a process of a lot of washing and cleansing for her to really kind of get down to oh what's the what's the spirit's use of it kind of in a fresh and innocent way really leading to spirituality or to a true experience of, of peace, not theologies and stances and rituals and the politics of denominations and fighting and all this and that. But there was a lot of washing that had to be done mm -hmm. with those concepts. So it really is a journey of unlearning and that's what these discussions and these devotionals are just opportunities for a speed up in terms of really washing the mind free of everything. For many, they have a very positive connotation, but, but even that can, can border on like, uh, like an obsessiveness mm -hmm. and a comfort with certain things, and then feels like, um, you know, where some people can have like an affront, like, what's wrong with, the, with that, you know, mm -hmm. you know, where it goes the other way, so it's just good.